Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna to give you a rundown of the different perfume websites that I use. I buy all my perfumes online. I might go into store to try them, but I always end up buying them online so I can get different discount codes and stuff. And I've had so many questions over the years around what do you think of this site? Is this site legit? Which is the best? So I'm gonna let you know all the ones I use and recommend and tell you a bit about them. If you are new here, then hello, welcome. We're all about perfumes. I have hundreds and hundreds of perfume review videos. So do check them all out. And if you're a regular but you haven't subscribed, then do hit that subscribe button and show your support. And I will leave the links to all these different websites down below in the description box. Cool, so I think first on my list and probably the one I use the most and um, well, certainly one of the most is Essential. So this is a company based in Wales here in the United Kingdom. They ship to the European Economic Zone and also to the US and I think some to the Middle East as well. They do do worldwide shipping. I find that they often do some really good deals. Every few months they tend to do this like 20% or 25% off or fragrance. That's a great way to get different perfumes and um, often they do have like the cheapest price available for a perfume and you also every time you shop you collect um, what they call pretty pennies which are like reward points which you can then redeem against the next purchase so I always get to redeem something each time I buy and the shipment is always totally fine comes in a few days you get a nail file every time and sometimes like samples as well so I just find they're reliable and the prices are good and they stock things like Dior, which a lot of sites don't stock, as well as some niche fragrances like Parfum de Mali. So another one that I use a fair amount is Fragrance Direct. These were started in 2000, so they've been around quite a while. And they, again, they ship to um, all around Europe and the US. And again, I find that these guys often have the best price for an item and they nearly always have some kind of offer on like spend 20 pounds get five pounds off or something or free delivery so it's usually a code that you can use as well and they definitely have a massive selection they also have a lot of perfumes that are you know a bit old been around for a while and um, so it's a good way to get ones that aren't being sold on other websites and again I find their delivery is totally fine so the one new website was well, not new but um, Debenhams here in the UK recently um, I guess went bust and then was bought by a brand called Boohoo and now they're just doing Debenhams online there are no Debenhams shops in Perth um, in person but what they have done is they've relaunched their beauty club and I think literally at the moment it's like you spend 30 pounds you get 20 pounds worth of beauty points and um, back when Debenhams was still going I used to use those beauty points so much because you just collect loads of rewards so it's really cool to see that that's back and again Debenhams has a lot of the more um, high-end brands like Chanel, Dior which aren't available on a lot of other websites so if you are a regular at Debenhams it's worth getting those points because they do add up. Another brand that I use a lot is Natino and um, they're actually based in the Czech Republic I think and they ship um, to UK Europe and they also have things like they get new releases often before other websites and they also have things like Victoria's Secret body sprays which are sometimes quite hard to find outside of the Victoria's Secret website um, so definitely do rate Natino though they often don't have as many codes and discount vouchers as some of the other ones. Another one which can be really good for um, older perfumes, different flankers, is allbeauty.com or .co.uk. They ship worldwide. I find that these guys have a huge stock of perfumes and again you can get some things really well discounted. And another similar one is Perfume Click. Um, they are usually, if I'm looking for one that's like really discontinued or really old, they tend to have it, um, perfumes that you can't find anywhere else. Their website is a bit um, old fashioned and some of their pictures look a bit like fuzzy and weird, but I think like I've ordered from them quite a few times and they're genuine perfumes. I think they just need a better website team. Um, and they do a thing where the more you buy, the more you save. So I think every new, every additional thing you buy, you get another pound off and 
they often have um, different discounts and stuff as well. Sometimes I use ASOS, um, they sell the Kayali fragrances and look fantastic as well, can be good if they've got an offer on. And then actually often the perfume brand websites themselves, for, um, like Armani, Lancome, Yves Saint Laurent, sometimes they will do really good offers like 20% off um, RRP and you can get gift sets there, sometimes you can get things you can't find anywhere else and you usually get really good samples with them, like a lot of good samples and beautiful packaging and it's definitely the best experience and if you get it on an offer then they can be just the same price as getting it elsewhere. Um, Fragrance Net in the US um, has a lot of discontinued good value perfumes and then of course um, the sort of classic high street shops like Boots here in the UK, Ulta in the US, Walgreens, Nordstrom, you know these guys are or, or, um, sometimes have exclusives like I think the new Ariana Grande Thank You Next 2.0 is exclusive to I think Walgreens in America right now and nowhere else has it in the world so that can be quite good as well and in Boots of course in the UK you get loads of points advantage card points which I love so I do um, tend to use that if they've got a good advantage card offer on. So yeah so those are my top recommendations let me know if there's any other websites you guys use and um, that you'd recommend let me know in the comments what's your experience of these which is your favorite let me know down down below um, and I will leave the links to all the ones I've mentioned down there as well um, but that's it guys so thanks so much for watching as always and I'll see you in the next video bye